what's really funny, so I was using Brain FM for a while. Um, I actually paid for this crap software for like two years, I'm embarrassed to say. Um, and it's just funny, I've actually realized, once I've looked into it now more, is I've played with a bunch of different softwares, and it's actually inverse between the, the price and the quality. So Brain FM is the most expensive one. Uh, you have to pay, I don't know, it's not super expensive, but I think it's like $50 a year or something like that. So it's the most expensive, and it's actually the worst quality app. It's like seriously, it's seriously terrible. Like it's the slowest app I've ever seen in my life. Like I have a 100 megabyte, or 120 megabyte per second internet here, and it's constantly just like lagging out and stopping and like going on and off, which is like really distracting. It's a tool that's supposed to get rid of distractions, and it's, it's constantly distracting you because it won't keep up. And also the mobile app is super, super slow. I've literally never used a mobile app that is that, like, it takes like 15 seconds to start it up, even if you're using offline mode. And the kicker is that there is no offline. So there is no offline mode, so you're just stuck with how slow this stupid, this stupid browser app is, um, which is terrible. So, um, but you know what's funny is I found one that is a terrible, terrible interface, but it is actually the best app. So, uh, Let's get this. Don't really need to save this. I don't quite care. So this one, I'll, I'll just show you this one. It, it's much, much better. This is it right here. SBA Gen. And it's not even like a real program. So all you do is, like, you have to install it, but you have to like go through all the crazy readme text to get the like really sketchy instructions. And it takes a little while to figure out, but honestly you can figure it out in like 10 minutes. And it's by way, way better than Brain FM, and it's completely free. It's for Mac and for Windows. So I have this folder here, and I can just like click on Focus. And these are just all different binaural beat patterns. You can layer them on top of each other. So if I open this up, so it just plays like some crazy note like this, and then I can open up like the second one. Um, then you can just layer them on top of each other as much as you want. So, like, they got a really good one for white noise. Um, I think it's this one. Not that one. Maybe focus. Yeah, anyways, it's just super, super basic. It doesn't ever lag out because it's on your desktop. It's super fast. It never, you know, it's not even like a real interface for the program. You just open up this folder and just are opening this stuff. Um, and it's completely free. So why would you ever pay for Brain FM? That is just like, you know, sure, it's got a fancy, nice looking interface and all that stuff. Um, I still got some freaking premium account on here for this like terrible, terrible quality app. But this is what you're paying for. You're paying for the shiny wrapper on here when the actual app is just like terrible and doesn't even work half the time. So definitely recommend checking this one out. I'll show you SBA Gen. Um, like I said, guys, it's not a nice interface. You're gonna have to mess around with it for at least 10 minutes to really figure it out. You're gonna have to like read through. They got like this help document in a freaking TXT that's like really complicated and most of it makes no sense at all, but like, and most of it's just like way too advanced for what you'd actually wanna use it for. But I just use it for focus. I just have this open on here and I can just layer on two or three of these tones and, and really, really help. So just wanted to show you that, guys. It's literally inverse. The best possible app, absolutely the best one, is completely free, and the one that has the nicest interface is, uh, you know, expensive and actually a really crappy app. So definitely check out SPA Gen.